hi guys welcome back in this video tutorial we are going to learn how we can create a photo in react native so actually photo is a very important part and uh, we need it uh, around every screen sometime uh, we have a common foot in the whole application so that how we can uh, do that so let's get started so this is an example how we can uh, how it will look like at the last of the video so you can see that this is the whole content and this is the photo and whenever you are going to uh, go on the another screen the photo will be same on the own screen so let's get started with that so, and i'm going to delete my code so so that we can create the code from very starting so i'm going to delete my folder and that's fine now now we have an empty screen so first of all I'm going to create a, a body part just take a view here and just give a style to it, this body part which is styles dot body define your body style here so I'm going to give a flex to my body part oops fine now I need a text here so that I can show you some text like so take a style here also and we can put a simply font size here like 20 And now just use background color so I can we can use sky blue and just use justify content it could be center align items align it could be center oops uh -uh. it should be align item or okay so just ignore it for some time and let's see we can see that uh, now we can use align items that's fine okay so this is our body part for now so just go and format it now we can take one more view oops that's my bad and we can take a text here also so here we can put the text part and just give a style like style equal to style stored footer
and give a background color like gold and we can use the two same properties here also so now just see the job okay just for give some space you can use the fonts uh, height here height equal to 50 so that's fine so this footer is work only one one screen so how we can make a common footer for all screens for that we have to create a different component of this part so just copy from here and okay so just put the same here Use a new file, put the name footer.js. Just copy the whole code to save the time because oh, a video in less time is always good, according to my way. So, okay, and we don't need the both of the both code also. So I can remove this code from footer style from here and now just remove the foot from footer code from from here. Okay, now import from footer screen footer you don't need to put dot gs extension here okay so we are at final step so here we uh, added the external footer and we can uh, add this footer the anywhere in any file and we can do one more thing if you want we can use touchable opacity here like on press use the arrow function here and call anything that is you want to call like, like a lot hi you clicked on footer so you can see that we get an alert here so thanks guys thanks for watching this video and if you still have any issue then let me know in by the comment and please don't forget to subscribe our channel and please give a thumbs up to the video if you like this video and please don't forget to uh, give a suggestion in the comment box also and you can like our facebook page which is given in the description video description thanks guys thanks for watching this video see you see you again